wings to fly won't take you to the stars. Use the metal for a boat and you won't sail too far. Stop sitting in the dark, stirring metal clouds about. You will change your life forever when you figure out. Secret pin code, pin code, Science can be tricky, it can overheat your brain. Science can be hard to chew, each bite can be a pain. Stop sitting in the dark, stirring metal clouds about. You will change your life forever when you figure out. Secret pin code. Your culinary genius is like the speed of light. It's simply unapproachable. Yeah, yeah, outstanding. Oh, stop it. <laughs> I haven't even tried it yet, and I already want seconds. Get in line, Brady Gut. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Bravo. Thank you, our hostess. Talking, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> what? Is something wrong? Excuse me, but why are these cakes salty? In the ice cream? <laughs> maybe you're tired, and maybe you mix something up. Who? Me? Tired? Not in a million years. Everything's under control. I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm just, uh, it was, uh, we were, I, I was kind of a April Fool, everyone. <laughs> it was just a joke. I was having you on. You should have seen your faces. <laughs> oh, I fooled you. <laughs> uh, isn't it July right now? Oh, mixing salt for sugar. The shame, the disgrace. That's a lifelong pan from the kitchen, that is. I can't keep up with it. Spheroscope, help me out here. Give me a universal recipe, please. Once and for all that will make everybody happy. Whoa, ho, ho. An unverified source of information. Well, that means we'll just have to verify it then. Food. The word means so much. At the end of the day, food is just batteries which supply us with the right amount of energy. Batteries without which, alas, we can't dispense with. And here's the rotten luck of it. We spend more energy on these batteries than they actually provide. Are you surprised? Me too. And it's all because food required additional processing. After all, in their raw form, they might contain dangerous bacteria or other parasites. Yuck! The most ancient way to process is using high temperatures. At high temperatures, most bacteria dies and food becomes safe to consume. This method was used by the very first cooks since the dawn of cooking. So what? A good method verified over time? Of course, but like all old methods, it also has significant drawbacks. 
On average, we spend 10 times more energy producing food than we actually get from it. Not to mention that the process can be incredibly tiring as well. And then what? Stop cooking altogether? Eat everything raw? There is a better way. Get away from the stove, woman. You need to relax. But who, pardon me, will do the cooking? Multi-chef, a unique invention with a fundamentally new way of cooking. Time and energy output is reduced to a minimum. With it, you'll forget all about burnt omelets and boiled over milk forever. Multi-chef is happiness which won't burn or boil over. Just one click and it's in your kitchen. Instantaneous delivery to any place in the time-space continuum. But I asked for cakes with, um, uh... Less talking at the table! Now enjoy your meal! How is it? Mmm! Mmm! <laughs> It's simply heavenly. Nom, 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 nom. Compression! Exactly! Who's for second? Mail run? Oh, sport is absolutely wonderful. But maybe we should have a little something to eat before we start. Yeah, that would be excellent. But you've just eaten! Yeah, yeah, that was very good. And we would be delighted to have another chance to evaluate your culinary prowess. Oh, you're flattering me, you gluttons! <laughs> How about something just as tasty, but without all the overeating? Well, what a pleasant feeling of lightness inside. Naturally! <laughs> Although we could actually run and eat at the same time. Less buoyancy! Seconds! Seconds! What the heck is going on here? Any questions you have will be answered by the customer service department of Multi-Chef. In the interest of quality improvement, all conversations will be recorded. Something wrong with that meat grinder. What have you mixed in there? You want to learn the secret of our magic taste? All right then. In the 20th century, prehistoric scientists believed that the Earth was flat and that all our flavor receptors were on the tongue. They imagined that there were only five types of receptors. Bitter, sweet, sour, salty, and a special receptor built for spicy food, fried meat and soy sauce. For this receptor, they even thought up a special name, umami. But science doesn't stand in one place. After a while, scientists wised up and discovered that those flavor receptors are scattered throughout the entire body, in the nose, lungs, and intestines, and in lots of other places, too. And of course, flavor sensations depend heavily on the smell of food. A new cooking era began after the discovery that the tastiest combinations are formed by foods which share harmonic overtones, like strawberries and cream, or bread and butter, or mmm, macaroni and cheese. After careful research, a full table of all flavor harmonies was made. 
It's difficult to understand, isn't it? But not for our multi-chef. Having processed all available data, it created a dish that has no equals in quality and a dish that's simply, absolutely, positively impossible to refuse. Are you sure this product is, well, harmless? When the population of the planet exceeded 20 billion, the concept of harmlessness became, lightly put, much simpler. After all, what could be more harmful than hunger? Scientists thought up a way to make artificial meat from animal stem cells. But pressing buttons on a complicated device that you haven't read the instructions for is definitely not recommended. And we are not legally liable or responsible for your actions. Wait! Wait! Wait, 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 wait! Ah, so it wasn't me cooking. It was this hellish meat grinder. As for me, I'm not good for anything anymore. I can't do anything on time. I mix ingredients. Food. 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 Stop it! Food. Stop it, I said! Stop it! Stop it! My favorite with cabbage leaves? Afraid not! <laughs> you are the only one who loves cakes with cabbage leaves, but New Year's a holiday for everyone! Not this time. Not this time. Redo it all. There's still time before midnight. No salutes on New Year's. I can't take all these flashes and noise. <laughs> take it all away. Take it all away. Wally! What do you order people around here for? By the power vested in me by the incoming new year, I forgive your ignorance. Someone might not make it to the new year. Ah, will somebody please explain to Rosa that in the upcoming new year, I will have immunity. You don't look immune to me. What are, what are you teasing me? Why, what year do you think is about to start? Um... 2000 and, um... No, it's the year of the blue wooden sheep. It is my year, mine. What don't you understand? Wally, I'm sorry, but in my opinion, you aren't even a sheep at all. But we can easily make you blue. <laughs> I am more sheep than all of you together. My New Year's friend, are you one of those, um, those people? Who are these people? One of those who believe in all that unscientific nonsense. My friend, that just isn't serious. Here we are, you understand, plowing through open space, and you're carrying on with all these old superstitions. You mean, I have no special status? And there won't be any special gifts? <laughs> I thought this would be a special New Year. Hey, only a few minutes left until New Year! I want something to eat. Mm, I'm really hungry. Give me a piece of that. What, what do we have there? Only five minutes left. Docco, tell us something about New Year's. As only you can. Well, if you insist, I could tell you about 
For example, parallel universes. New Year's is a big holiday for us. But for the universe, one year is but a split second. Because it is, after all, older than 13 billion years. It was that many years ago that there was a Big Bang which gave rise to our world. Scattered particles flew into atoms and atoms into molecules, from which later entire clouds of cosmic dust were formed. Fast forward a billion years and those clouds have turned into galaxies. The bright strip of stars in our sky is the galaxy in which we live. Ancient Greeks called this strip the Milky River, or the Milky Way. And milk in Greek is galaxies. It was from this that we started referring to large clusters of stars as galaxies. Despite the fact that the Big Bang happened a long time ago, galaxies continue to fly apart at an enormous rate. The farther away a galaxy is from Earth, the faster it moves away from us. This theory was discovered by astronomer Edwin Hubble. It means that at some distance from Earth, there are galaxies which are flying away from us at the speed of sound. This distance is called Hubble's radius, and it indicates that we will never see the worlds beyond the boundaries of Hubble's radius, since light from them simply can't reach us. Alas, the size of the visible part of our universe is only 93 billion light years. Our entire universe can be conditionally divided into such Hubble spheres. And if we assume that space-time is infinite, then due to the theory of probability, somewhere along those worlds there is an exact copy of ours, or, as they say, a parallel universe. But we'll never see it at all, insofar as every year it's flying farther and farther. Cool! It's already midnight! Cheekster, preparation level D1! Always ready! Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five! Another silly New Year's. Just the same as all the other previous ones. I wish I were in some kind of parallel universe instead. doing in Rose's room? Uh, 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 what is this? Where, uh, where, where are my horns? Uh, where are they? Here, Here we are. are. Velma. Uh, 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 uh. Printing and preeping already. Holy carrots. You're such a sweetheart. Promise me that New Year's will be as lovely as you are. Let's go. Everyone's already waiting for you. And here is the start of tonight's festivities. Oh, how delightful. Yeah, yeah. That is fantastic. I'm sleeping. Oi. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you don't want to sleep through New Year's, do you, cutie? Well, that would be incredibly sad. Well, what's going on here? Is this some kind of prank? Why do you all look like... Ah. Like overdressed princesses. Only Velma is truly beautiful. Beautiful as always. And here's the New Year's cake, you pranksters! Oh, Oinga. At least everything with you still the same. Oh, <laughs> what could happen to me? <laughs> There you go, with cabbage leaves, just for you. Holy carrots! Time to give gifts to the New Year's girl! Oh, yes. And did you know? Yes, you know. You'll never lose that way. Stop it! That's enough! This is too peculiar, New Year's. I don't want this. I liked you better earlier. So, have we changed? Did we gain weight? No, not that. 
the other yous from the other universe. Doko, what were you talking about, parallel universes? I'm sorry, are you talking to me? I'm gonna. Whatever. What, what's the deal with those circles and galaxies and with the stars? Ah, uh, stars. I can tell you your horoscope. Spheroscope. Should still be spheroscope in this universe, then or whoever you are. Where is it? I don't understand. That round gift that, from the future that a horse gave you. Oh, darling, are you talking about that wonderful New Year's toy that Colt gave her? Yeah, yeah, my cult is so romantic. Oh. Nine! You broke that gift from my cult! How can I get back to my own world? Your request is too vague. But I got here somehow through that uh, uh, big black thingamajig. A black hole is a space object with extremely strong gravitational attraction. All objects produce a curve in the time-space continuum with their gravitational field. The larger the object, the stronger the curvature. The mass of a black hole is so large that its distortion of space and time can be visualized in the form of a bottomless funnel. A black hole's pull is so strong that even quantum light cannot escape. Therefore, you can't see a black hole. Upon hitting a black hole, all information about its existence is erased and can't be restored, as its physical characteristics are still poorly understood. Distortion of space and time. I don't understand what it is, but it sounds promising. Set a course for a black hole. Forgive me, sweetheart, but the helm won't tolerate a female's touch. That's how! <laughs> no! What now? Are we not gonna have any new years? Huh? rain and how much snow did fall and all that hope which failed us all five minutes left my oh my time truly does pass us by through the clouds, a single ray of light. Everyone waiting for some holy sight. Five minutes left, my oh my. Time truly does pass us by. Uh-huh. 